Are you suffering from low back pain? Well, low back pain is the most common cause of job-related disability. According to a review, at least 80% of Americans will experience low back pain in their lifetime. Mostly, low back pain results from an injury, such as muscle sprains or strains due to sudden movements or poor body mechanics while lifting heavy objects. Low back pain can also be the result of certain diseases, such as cancer of the spinal cord, a ruptured or herniated disc, sciatica, arthritis, kidney infections, or infections of the spine. But don't worry, in most cases, it's temporary and called acute back pain, and it can last anywhere from a few days to a few weeks, while chronic back pain is pain that lasts for longer than three months. Well, why and how is the pain so common? Low back pain is more likely to occur in individuals between the ages of 30 and 50. This is partly due to the changes that occur in the body with aging. For example, as you grow older, there's a reduction in the fluid content between the vertebrae and the spine. This means discs in the spine experience irritation more easily. It can also lose some muscle tone, which makes the back more prone to injury. This is why strengthening your back muscles and using good body mechanics help prevent low back pain. There are some causes of low back pain you should know, so you can avoid them and become more careful in the future. Disc Injury The discs in the back are prone to injury. The risk increases with age. The outside of the disc can tear or herniate. Strains The muscles and ligaments in the back can stretch or tear due to excess activity. Abnormal spine curvatures, scoliosis, kyphosis, and lordiosis are all conditions that cause abnormal curvatures in the spine. Spinal Stenosis Spinal stenosis is when the spinal column narrows, putting pressure on the spinal cord and spinal nerves. Arthritis is an inflammation of the joints. Fibromyalgia is a long-term pain and tenderness in the joints, muscles, and tendons. What are the treatment options for low back pain? Home care. Self-care methods are helpful for the first 72 hours after the pain begins. However, if the pain doesn't improve after 72 hours of home treatment, you should call your doctor. Stop your normal physical activities for a couple days and apply ice to your lower back. Doctors generally recommend using ice for the first 48 to 72 hours, then switching to heat. Alternate ice and heat to relax muscles. The RICE protocol, rest, ice, compression, and elevation, is recommended within the first 48 hours. How can you prevent low back pain? There are many ways to prevent low back pain. Practicing prevention techniques may also help lessen the severity of your symptoms if you have a lower back injury. Prevention involves exercising the muscles in your abdomen and back, losing weight if you're overweight, lifting items properly by bending at the knees and lifting with the legs, maintaining proper posture, you may also want to sleep on a firm surface, sit on supportive chairs that are at the correct height, avoid high-heeled shoes, quit smoking if you smoke. Nicotine causes degeneration of the spinal discs and also reduces blood flow. Talk to your doctor about your lower back pain. They can diagnose the cause and help you create a treatment plan that works best for you. That's all about the back pain. So if you want to get rid of your back pain, follow these steps. These are the generic way to treat and prevent back pain. It's always best to consult a doctor under any severe condition. If you like our video, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any future videos. Here are two more videos on the screen you should check out. They'll help you achieve your health and fitness goals. See you in our next video.